Hey Polish peeps, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new. Y'all, I have made an executive decision and I'm gonna tell y'all why I've made that decision. I um, cannot keep up with my hauls. <laughs> I buy polish way too fast for me to keep up with being able to swatch them on swatch sticks and swatch them on my swatch wheel and mat them up for y'all so y'all can see what that looks like. And I really enjoy sharing my hauls with you guys but I just don't have enough time to fit into my schedule. And then I have so much polish out. It's not put away. It drives me nuts because I have a little bit of OCD. So I have decided that instead of waiting until I have had a chance to swatch them on swatch sticks and my swatch wheel, I'm going to share, share with you guys my hauls. And I'm just going to show you bottle shots because I have way too many polishes. So I have, and I think if you've, watched my polish um room tour you guys kind of see how i organize my polishes in these little baskets and i have um let's see one two three four five six seven eight nine ten there's also one in my bedroom um of these baskets to share with you guys and also some other polishes that didn't have room to go in the basket because i ran out of basket space so um that's how many I have to share with you guys, and I really want to just get through all of them and just show you guys what I've bought. I mean, these go all the way back to, like, before, like, June, July of last year, y'all. Like, I cannot wait any longer. I've got to get through these with you guys. Either that or I don't get to share them, and I really love sharing them with you guys. So, I grabbed a basket. We're just going to go through. I'm just going to show you guys bubble shots of what I got. And if I remember, I'll try to explain to you where I got them from. Um, and we're just gonna, we're just gonna roll with it. Okay, so I have this one by Caddy Lacquer. This is Little Things. I don't remember what collection I got these from. I think I remember there was a sale or something at some point, and I was like, ooh, I have got to have these. And this is so pretty. I love the pink glitters in this one. Um, also from, I guess, that same time period, this is Illuminate. And look how pretty this is. Y'all, this screams fall. And I already have my fall rack up. I'm not adding any more to it. So maybe next year this one will get, will get worn or thrown on my fall rack. But look how pretty that is. I love those flakies. Another one. This is a Bad Dream. Also from Cadillacer. And it's a gorgeous purple. Looks like a blue shimmer there. Also looks like some reflective... Uh, either glitter or powder. I want to say this is probably reflective powder. It's a little bit more delicate in the base, but look at that shimmer, y'all. Oh my gosh, so pretty. Here's another one. This one's Be Somebody, also from Cadillacer. It's pink with, looks like lilac glitters. Oh my gosh, y'all. And it also has a shimmer. Look how pretty. I am so excited about these, and who knows, y'all, with my massive collection, when I will get a chance to wear these. No clue, but that's a really pretty pink. Okay, it looks like that's all of the caddy lacquers that I have in this particular basket. Not to show you guys. No, I'm lying. <laughs> I am definitely lying. Y'all, oh my gosh. This is Don't Make a Sound from Caddy Lacquer PPU, but y'all are going to die because this is going in a D stash because I... Um, also have this one on my winter rack. So why I have two of them, I don't know. I'm going to assume that I probably bought it the first time and then forgot I bought it and bought it for PPU Rewind. I don't, I don't exactly know, but I mean, it's gorgeous. So maybe I just thought I needed a backup or something, but I haven't worn it. So I don't know <laughs> why, but I have two of these. Y'all, this is another reason why I need to go through my hauls a lot faster than I do so that I can remember what I buy and not buy it twice, because this happens to me quite often. Okay, I have some ethereals to share with y'all. This is Butterfly Bobble from June 2022 um, release, one of her releases. Oh my gosh, y'all look how pretty. That is so gorgeous. It looks like it's probably gonna be a little sheer on the nail, but I will probably just wear a, um, nail blurring base coat and roll with that because look at that oh my gosh so pretty i also remember buying from this collection some like um nail blurring base coats because i needed some 
ones in like a kind of different shade. This is not, I don't remember. I think this is one of the nail blurring base coats. Yeah, so I have three different colors. So this is hibiscus and I feel like this could be worn as like a little wash of color on the nails as well because look at that pretty that's a really really pretty shade but it also will work as a as a nail blurring base coat for something similar to this shade like it would work with this i think like that would work to make that a little bit more opaque on the nails i also have one called rose and it is saying butterfly base so that's what that is. It's a nail blurring base coat in this color rose. And then I also have one, it's kind of a lavender color and it's called lavender. And I remember thinking when I bought these, like, this is brilliant. I, because I'm always wanting to use um, nail blurring base coats, but I only had two before. And sometimes they didn't quite jive with the polish I was trying to put over it. So I'm really glad to have these three different shades to use for nail blurring base coats. Um, also, I have Thinking of Blue. This is from June 2022. One of Ethereal's releases. Look at that gorgeous shimmer. Oh, it's a gorgeous blurple with like some I don't know, holographic shimmer. I don't, I don't know. It's just shimmery goodness. And here is sky blue also from the same collection it's like a gray base with it looks like a green shimmer it's green but it's also something else <laughs> it's um that's that base is gorgeous i really like the shade and then i have papillion i feel like i'm saying that wrong but um hello purple that's really pretty and it's kind of breaking up in the bottle a little bit. So I'm going to shake it up a little bit so you guys can see what that looks like. I think it's just the flakies that are like laying um, kind of flat on the side of the bottle. But this also has a gorgeous shimmer. You guys can see there. Um, let's see. I have one from Nevermind Polish. Yeah, I have no idea where I got this from. But this is some Nophilia. And again, these have been sitting for a hot minute, y'all. Like more than a hot minute. Like it, they've really been sitting here. But hello, Purple Hollow. Oh my gosh, it's so pretty. You guys cannot see the hollow. And that is going to look so gorgeous on the nails. I have one for Polish for, Gay Polish for Days Opal Watermelon. I remember actually getting this one from. This was from July PPU um, Rewind Month. Obviously, I missed it the first time and thought <laughs> I have so many regrets. I need to get it. So that one's really pretty pink. Oh my gosh, that shimmer is gorgeous. I also picked up Neon from PPU by Polish. Um, look at that neon. I can't wait to wear this one for summer. I'm kind of regretting now that I missed a whole entire summer and did not get this on my nails. Cause look how bright that is. That is insanely bright, y'all. Like this is not by any stretch of the imagination a camera trick. Like, like that's what that, that's literally what that is. Oh my gosh, so pretty. Then I have Centaur of Attention. I think this is a backup cause I wanna say I picked this one up the first time and it's probably in a bucket over there. I don't even know if I've, um, I feel like I may have done the haul on this one, but this one was a, I need a backup moment. And I'm really glad I got this one as a backup. Pretty sure my friend Carolina got this one as a backup too. And she was like, yes, I'm so happy I have that as a backup. So, um, that's Bluebird Lacquer Centaur of Attention. Um, I have Blackberry Lambic from Top Shelf Lacquer and no telling where I got this from, but look at that gorgeous purple. Um, I probably have something similar to this, but there's so much cat hair in here, y'all. But I needed the hollow. So you guys can't really see really well, but it's this is a deep, deep, dark purple base. 
with some holographic glitter. It's really pretty. I have Connie's Nosy Neighbor from Colors by LaRoe. It's a gorgeous purple blurple. Um, and it's got like, I think it's a purple shimmer. It looks like it might shift to something else, but there's definitely prominent purple. And I don't know where I got this, but this bottle looks like it wasn't quite filled to the top. So maybe I got it in a D-stash. That's possible. I probably got this in a D-stash. No, I know exactly where I got this from. This was gifted to me um, by my lovely, amazing friend, Jay. So I purchased some um, polishes from her and... It was around the time of my wedding and so she sent me some extra polishes and this was one of them that's why it has a little fill line but it's so pretty look how pretty that is she sent me i'm also thinking now that's why i don't remember buying these other ones um because she wanted to send me some purple goodness because she knows purple is my favorite color so she sent me those um she also sent me this one from nail artisan cosmetics and this is from February 2022 PPU and it looks like it's a magnetic but it's another gorgeous purple and I'm gonna actually grab my magnet from back here so I can show you guys Ooh. trying to fall off my lap Ooh, that's really pretty can't wait to wear that one because purple Okay, she also sent me, I hope she doesn't mind that I mentioned her name in here. I don't think she will. Um, Love and Madness from another, it's another Colors by LaRoe, and it's a gorgeous, like, fairy shade with gold shimmer. Ooh, that's pretty. That's going to look really amazing with my skin tone. Like, look. Mm, I like that. And she sent me this one. Did she send me this one? Y'all. She sent me a bunch. I just, I can't remember all of them. <laughs> I think this was one. Malama, Malama from Hella Handmade Anniversary by Swamp Gloss. And this one. Oh my god, y'all. Holy crap. Like, look at that. Those flakies. Jeez Louise. Oh my god. I'm in love with this one. Like, I want to put this one on right now. I know this one's going to look amazing. Um, I also got Cyber Monday 2021 from... Heart and Promises. Look how pretty that one is. It's also purple with some really pretty glitters in there. I also got this one from KB Shimmer. Shimmer. This is Purple Rain. And y'all, what? <laughs> I am in love with purple. I seriously think it is the most gorgeous color on the face of the earth and I could get just everything in purple and be perfectly happy with my life like I could seriously get it and just be like I need everything purple and purple clothes purple walls purple everything just purple um this is another one from May PPU from Hearts and Promises Once Upon a Time <sighs> y'all these flakies Look at that. Look at this gold flakies. This face is gorgeous too. That is super pretty. Really love that. Once upon a time. Okay, and then I did purchase from her some polishes from Enchanted Polish because as you guys probably know, or maybe you don't know, um, Enchanted Polish does not do polishes anymore and I had none and I was feeling left out. <laughs> so I was like, I need some polishes from some um, enchanted polishes in my life and she sent me ones that she thought I would really like and I love them so this is and I can't really try I can't wait to try these out because this brand has been calling to me for ever since I started seeing other people's swatches and other people's pictures of this polish like I was like oh, that looks amazing and I need some enchanted polish in my life so this is Helotrope and it's a gorgeous lavender with holographic uh, shimmer there 
This is Storytelling and it's a deep purple with like silver holographic. That is going to look so amazing on the nails. Cannot wait. Then I have, this is actually not one from um, Enchanted Polish. This is from Bare Polish and I'm going to shake it up a little bit because it's settling really bad so you can't really see. There's a um, different color on the top. I will probably not get this shaken up good enough, but you can kind of see. So it's another lavender with, looks like silver holographic maybe. I don't know. It's just a like, it's a purple shimmer. I don't know if you guys can even see. But it's a purple shimmer and it does have like some sc scattered holographic glitters in there, like micro glitters. And have another one from Enchanted Polish. This is January 2017. And this one looks like a looks like a black base. Or maybe it's a clear with like a black um, holographic. And so I'm, I don't no, I think it is a black base, but it is really pretty. Really pretty hollow, gorgeous. And there is some purple shimmer in there. I don't know if you guys can see that a little bit. She did a really good job picking polishes for me because this is not one that I would typically pick for myself, but she probably did like this and saw that purple shimmer in there and was like, oh, she's going to love this. And she was so right about that. So pretty. And I have, lastly, this is April 2017 and it is another like lavender, but it looks like it's in a, well, it's in like a pink, pink base with like lavender shimmer and if I shake it up you guys can see oh wow that is oh this is what looks so good on the nails my dog is so extra at the window right now <laughs> this is gonna look amazing that is just gorgeous look at that oh I love that so pretty Okay, that is all of the polishes in this basket, y'all. I did that in 17 minutes and then some, a little bit. So I actually have some place to go, but I want to do another basket. Probably do another basket after this, or maybe when I come back from where I'm going. Because um, I want to get through these baskets pretty quickly, and so I can get them put away. I don't know why, but they're just like, for some reason, right now in this moment, them being out is really <laughs> an issue for me. So... Thank you guys for watching. If you're joining me for the first time, um, please consider subscribing. Hit that notification button at the bottom. We talk about all things nail polish related. We do lots of hauls, lots of nail related content. Um, I throw in some other things every now and then. I really want to start doing some makeup content. I wish y'all could see my dog right now. But anyway, I really want to do some makeup content. I haven't decided what that's going to look like yet. And I've actually gotten a lot of positive feedback from you guys about possibly throwing in a video here and there on that. But don't worry, it's still going to be all nail related content for the most part. But I may throw in just a couple of other things um, makeup related, although I'm not like an expert by any means. Um, so look for that. If you're interested in something like that, um, give it a thumbs up so I know I'm doing a good job, good job for you guys. And thank you guys so much for watching. I love you guys so, so much. And I will see you in the next video. Bye, Polish Beats. Make sure you subscribe. <laughs> Bye.